Hello everyone, welcome back to Mike's Garage. Um, so today I'll probably be posting two uh, videos. Um, I made one about custom parts that I'm looking to build for the 3rd Gen SHO a few days ago, but I haven't got around to posting that, so I'm probably going to post it here in a bit. Um, but right away into this video, um, we got some 60,000 mile, or 70,000 now, is 60 when I bought it, but 70,000 mile SHO 3rd Gen seats. This is the only damage on either seats. That's the little rip the driver's side seat always gets. Um, but otherwise, these are in mint condition, both seats. Really, really nice. Um, and I'm looking to sell both of them. So if it's local pickup, I'll give you both seats for 700 bucks. If I got to ship it, I want 900 for both seats. Um, anyways, we'll move along here and get right into the main point of this video. So as everyone who is an owner of the 3.4 liter SHO knows, these motors grenade themselves because the cams were made very poorly. They pressed the lobe onto the shaft and they tend to slip. And then you got a blown motor. Um, nobody has ever produced cams that I know of for these that are stronger or an upgrade where it's not going to break or anything like that. And if someone has, correct me. But currently, I do not believe any are in production. So last night, I spent an hour on the phone with a very reputable cam manufacturer. Um, I won't say who because this is a project between me and him, and we got to, you know, keep it between us since we're going to be doing this. But, um, we're going to be making a set of cams for my motor to begin with. So uh, I'm taking the cams out today and I'm going to be sending them to him. Uh, and then he is going to check everything out and probably regrind these ones um, so we can actually test the numbers on the profile that we're going to do. The, to begin with, we just want it to work great with the stock ECU and stock everything. So it's going to be very, very minutely more aggressive. Just a tiny bit more lift, some more duration, but that's about it. Um, so he told me if I can get 10 custom orders lined up for camshafts, we can probably make custom um, cold forged cams for the 3.4 liter. So that means they're going to be about two grand a piece. If I can get 10 pre orders of, for each set of cams, um, then we can actually have finally Amistry Racing cold forged cams for the 3.4 liter SHO V8. Now, again, cams are. The biggest problem with this motor and so if I get enough interest I hope this video ends up on YouTube if enough of you want it um, I'm gonna let everybody know down in the description how to get a hold of me um, and then I'll tell you about the whole process on these cams um, all of this is going to be safe of course if you do the pre-orders it's all gonna happen through PayPal you'll be given a date when to expect the cams and all that I'm guessing if I can get the 10 pre-orders in by let's say October we can have our cams for our 3.4 liter SHOs by January and uh, that would be awesome I think personally I'm pretty excited about it so hopefully I get enough interest in this if I don't get a lot of interest in this and uh, nobody wants to do the pre-orders then I'm just making cams for myself and nobody else is getting them so anyways that's what this video today is about I need to know if anyone's interested in cams for this they will be streetable you can run them with fully stock everything and then if i do get 10 pre-orders for the more aggressive street cams on this next year if this is a success we'll be looking at stage two and stage three cams as well so race profiles where other stuff is going to have to be upgraded but we'll finally have a little bit of aftermarket support for this so uh Thank you guys for watching. Thank you for the support. Um, check out my last video. I'll be posting both of these today. My last video explains a potential cold air intake kit that I'll be selling for the 3.4 liter SHOs or third gen SHO, a battery relocation kit in the back, and then a few other things that I'll be making for this, including a handbrake, which I'll sell a handbrake kit too, if enough people obviously are interested. So again, thank you guys for watching. Thank you for all the support. I look forward to hearing from people and I hope there's enough interest in camshafts that we can actually get some made for this car and not just for me. <laughs> thank you guys for watching.